vegetable. Hello there, and welcome to episode 96 of my series, where I try to play the towns, cities and urban areas of Norway perfectly on GeoGuessr. That is, trying to achieve a score of 25,000 points for each game. Today we have made it to the twin cities of Sheen and Porskrun. And this is one of those... Uh, this is one of those games where I've, I've been struggling with myself, whether I should split this into a playthrough of the town or of the city of Porskrin and the city of Sheen, rather than both of them. But they have grown together and they are considered a single urban area these days. And uh, I had the same discussion with myself concerning Fredrikstad and Sarpsburg as well on the other side of the fjord here, which also effectively have grown together into, into, into forming one urban area. And I did that as a single play, as a single map, so we will do this as a single map, and unless someone protests vehemently, I will uh, split them into two episodes later. So yeah, uh, so Shean was uh, grew up uh, as a uh, city, industrial city centered on um, on processing wood and um, and. Uh, you know, shipping out of of, uh, of logs and timber from uh, from the waterways up here. Uh, you have the uh, Telemark Canal that runs all the way from from Sheen down here, and all the way up through the rivers and lakes until you come up here to Dalen. And uh, so it's complete with locks and. And everything and that will take you all the way up there, and that was quite handy for getting the logs down to the city. Porskun has had a different outlook, so you can say that Shen has had an inwards outlook, while Porskun has had, a, had an outwards one, as being a shipping harbor for a long time, as well as a customs city. And it has also got some main or major um, industry, like the Hadea Industrial Estate, where you'll find. Uh, Norsk Hydro, which is a big uh, producer of various um, various uh, electrochemical things, as well as the uh, artificial um, artificial. Um, come on, brain work, will ya? Um, artificial fertilizer factory of Yara, and uh, there are on the other side of the fjord here. There are oil refineries and whatnot. So Poshkun is very much a petrol, chemical, electro, slash whatever industrial city. And together they form the city of Sheen Poshkun. There's about 95,000 people living in this area. And uh, as you can see, we have loads of locations here. So I guess the chances of hitting the downtown are even smaller than have been in previous games. So let's have a look. I've never been to Shena Pushkin in order to do things, as I've always been passing through. So, um, I've never. Well, I've, I've been to downtown Shein once years and years ago, and I sort of got an impression of the place, but that's pretty much it. Um, let's see, Fardman Vein. Fardman. That would be. A traveling man, uh, not not in the sense of a, a, per, a person from the traveling people, but uh, basically just one who travels far and wide. So we've got the Farman Road, and we got the Roe Deer Road, and that could of course be anywhere. And I got a little roundabout. The funny thing was though, right? So. Which is the most recent footage? OK, 
Okay, so they actually remove the roundabout. That's uncommon. But I think this is a sort of road that might not require one. Let's go west. Even if this Farman road doesn't seem to be a main road. Scott, the bulkhead. Mm, so I guess we might find some more naval themed ones. Except that this is the Violet Road. Leading us on to, I guess, the road we were on initially, which was the Road Deer Road. And there's a large one. A Kostvein. <laughs> the Glance Road. That's an odd one. But okay. Yep. And the Road Deer Road. And let's see. So, 36 going off in two directions, and uh, I do believe we are looking at the industrial estate at Hadoya, out here. So, let's see, and we're looking, we're not on the 36, but we're coming up on it. So, here's the road here, road. So right now we're here, and here's the Farman Road, and here's the roundabout that they have removed. And, but which way did I go? Mm. Oh yes, I was here. Um, mm -mm -mm, so, that is this house, and that. Is this so that puts us there? Turn around and see that we're looking past this house. Yes, but we're just clipping it southwards. Yes, that should be all right. Oh, more than all right, actually. Oh, this is an odd mixture of the old and the somewhat more recent. Racing Jure. Okay, so Jure, that's a cultivated field. And that's a church. Are we in the Borgestad area? What does it say? I think it says Yet. In that case, we are far north in Sheehan. Yerpen used to be a very good handball team. And then we're talking about the European version of handball, not the American one. Uh, and uh, we're also talking about the version of handball that is represented in the Olympics. So Yerpen used to be a very good Norwegian handball team for years until they got themselves into economical trouble, which a lot of these clubs have a habit of doing when they when their breaches get a little too large and they want to grow a little too fast. And uh, here's the church. So let's see, no, that's the church, that's not the church, here's the church. The Red School. Could that be the on. Let's see now. So that's the primary school over there. And then we have this very stately looking building, which uh, for some reason. Wait a minute. I'm not looking at the right place, am I? So we have the church over there. Which road is this? So the church is off to the east. And we should be on this road. And that thing down there must be this. 
And for some reason, unless of course this is the horse clinic, which I guess it is. Yes, that makes sense. Then we have this old larder here, which is that one. And then we have, if you would like to move a little bit, and we have a red house over yonder. Where my baby used to where my baby used to live. I know she did. Uh, just paraphrasing Jamie Hendrix. Yep. And this was the Riesing Jure. Which is here. And we are standing about yeah, there. <laughs> oh crud. Okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine, thirty, thirty-one, thirty-two, thirty-three, thirty-four, thirty-five, thirty-six, thirty-seven, thirty-eight, thirty-nine, forty, forty-one. 41. Okay, let's remember that and then figure out which tunnel this is. I think I have an inkling. Yes, this is uh, over. This is one of those coming down the hill here, isn't it? Is it this one? Nope. Here we are. Okay, so we are on 41 inside this tunnel. 41 going east. Now we go west. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28. 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, 40, 41, 42, 43, 44, 45, 46, 47, 48, 48, and 41 is 89. Let's just have a look here. So 89. Let's just gamble on this being the middle. So we've got to go oh, 41 in that direction. So the middle here is. No, wait a minute. So the whole area is 89, so that is 44 and a half. And then this is. That is twenty two and a quarter, and this is um, eleven and some tiny change. So that's thirty three and some. Let's just call it thirty three. And then this is. Uh, 38, almost 39, we're going to call it 39, and then between the, uh, there and there is 41 and a half, I'm going to say there, and we're on the, we're on the south side of the road. <laughs> If this works, I'll be a very happy player. But we're likely to be within 50 rather to be within 25 meters. Ooh, nice. <laughs> Ooh, we got out of that one unscathed. Thank goodness me. Okay, and uh, now we're in Winkelgat of the Angle Street. Alright, we are at the crossroads, so intersection with the Angle Street. 
And yet another residential area. But it seems to be fairly close to downtown wherever. Hmm. We got... Is this Skagera Karina? Yes, it is. Right. So this is the home ground of... Uh, Odd. <laughs> it doesn't mean strange. Odd means spear point in Norwegian. And uh, Odd is one, or Odd Grenlon. Grenlon is the sort of, well, it's the name of this entire area here, and it's called Grenlon. And Odd Grenlon is uh, this area is a representative in the Norwegian Premier League. So let's see, we should be able to find the wink, uh, not the winkle, the <laughs> angle street, that's the angle street, not the wink one. Yep. And there we go. Yes. And then the final round. Oh, that's so bad for you. Um, hmm. Let's go south, even if it's uphill. The sea, I think. Or is it a lake? Are we up in Scotfuss or something like that? Like, will we be... I wonder... Yeah, this is very much the last starting to look like a dead end, and it was. Okay, and then we go the other way. And we head down the hill to see if we can figure out what the name of this place is. Uh, let's see. Nedra. Does it say Bara? Okay, I'm not going to try and guess that one. Yeah, over the border. And where is this? Does it say on the bus shed? It says... Grötsen. Porridge. The Porridge Street. And this one is called Grötsenvein. Okay. So could that be down here? And the answer to that seems to be no. Here we are. Grötsundvein. This is going to be a fun one. I think we're somewhere around there. So let's see. So we got numerous houses on the downside here and nothing on the upside. Mm, let's see if we can find that house. That should help me to locate. So this is a red house, okay? So here's this house. What's that one? Turn around. And we have this house. Next up is no houses. Then we get a white house. And then we get a red house. Just that one. Move. Perpendicular. More or less at the middle of the house. Although it's. Okay, I'll go with that. Southwards takes us just to the corner of the house. And we should be there. In Porridge Street. It's a Porridge Street Road. And we end with a bullseye. Nice. Okay. I like the spread of that. <coughs> Excuse me. And that uh, worked quite well. Now we got, we actually got three bullseye in that round. Nice, 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 nice. I like that. So yeah, uh, still downtown areas eluding us, but I think that gave us a fair impression of the place. 
So that is episode... Uh, what did I say? Did I say 95 or 96? Oh, whatever. You'll find out which the next episode is tomorrow. So, until then, bye-bye. Thank you.